and she got a chicken out of the pan and she turned it upside down and I thought that was kind of peculiar and she grabbed it by the neck and she swung it over her head about three times and she snapped it out there and the body of the chicken separated from the head and that chicken body was hopping around squirting blood out the top of its stump and, and I was stunned <laughs> three years old so and the chicken was coming towards me and I jumped up on the stump to get away from it right in 1960 in Okinawa Sensei Tatsuo Shinobuku promoted me to Shodan I had seen a lot of breaking demonstrations. I had seen three demonstrations that we did where the black belts broke tile. And I kind of want to do it myself. Now, the, the Americans, when they started to break, they would measure. They would measure and measure and measure, and finally they'd break them. The Okinawans, they didn't, they didn't measure anything. They walked up, bam, one punch, broke them. Take the left hand, pull the tile up to show that they broke them all. The next Okinawan come out, do the same thing. They didn't measure, man, they just popped them. So I kind of wanted to see what I could do. So I went to a little mom and pop place that made tile and brick, and I bought me some. Went back to the dojo, and, and I, I took two brick, and, and put another brick on it, and I chopped it with a shoe toe, and I broke the brick. Sensei said, next time, make a fist like this. He said, it gives you more cushion. It was the same fist that he used when he drove the nail. And I saw him drive the nail. And he said, do it this way next time. So I put two bricks up, and I broke two bricks. And he said, Johnson can do two. And I said, hi, Sensei, hi means yes. He said, next time we demonstration go, you break it too. I said, okay. He said, every day, chop 15 minutes each hand. In two years, you can knock the head off a bottle. You can chop the head off a chicken. And then <laughs> I jumped back to that childhood memory when I was three years old. And I thought, in my mind, it's if great. I gave a demonstration and I chopped the head off a chicken and the blood was squirting all over the place and the chicken was running everywhere, how many students would I get out of that? <laughs> I love and him so much. I do. Woo! Now, my students never went to the chicken test. <laughs> so I don't know in a tight spot whether they would face the chicken or jump up on the stump. <laughs> now, my students, I can't believe how, how loyal they are, how loving they are. 